What up? Tyler here from TarverAcademy.com, and I'm going to tell you a quick tip on doing well in an online class. If you're in college, you're probably doing online classes, especially if you're doing your master's or graduate level stuff, then uh, you're definitely going to do some online classes. Um, but now you're seeing a lot of those in high schools and junior highs, uh, more high schools than junior high. But I want to give you a quick tip. When you're doing your work for an online class and the whole class is laid out for you, my recommendation for today is do your work early. It's very easy to procrastinate. It's very easy to look at the due date or the deadline and just kind of wait till that happens. Don't. Because whenever your teacher is grading that stuff online, if you can get it to them early and they can see some mistakes or some things you should correct, it's really easy for them to send it back to you and say, hey, correct this or fix this. Because a lot of online teachers will do that, especially if you'll approach them with like, hey, can you look at this before I submit it? Send them to them. That's, I mean, that's the thing. They're teachers, so like in a regular classroom, they would help you out if you just like went up and asked them, hey, how do I do this? Online classes are a little different because you might not see your teacher every day or at all. So when you send it to them beforehand, it's like saying, hey, can you take a look at it? And guess what? They're probably the one grading it. Unless they got like a graduate assistant or an automatic program. They can look at it and they can help you out and guide you on that. It's going to help your grade. So the earlier you can get it done and send it off to your teacher to look at it first. Or just get it done early so they can send it back to you if there's any revisions. That's great advice. Now I know I struggle with procrastination. Don't tell anybody. I, was, I saved that till the end of the video because I procrastinated telling you that outright. But that's one thing that you should work on if you're doing an online class. So that's my best advice. Please subscribe. And as always... Get your learn on.